Hello there ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another episode here on Pastiche of Skin. We are playing another Final Fantasy game. This time it is Unking's Tale Final Fantasy 15. Yes, this was a game that was actually part of the premium bundle for Final Fantasy 15. We never got released not that long ago and has now gone available free to play and completely free for everyone to enjoy on PlayStation Network. Now, what I know about it, it's a scrolling beat -em up with a story-based element that takes place long, long before the plot of Final Fantasy 15 and in fact involves the main character, Noctis' father. So... We're going to jump into this and get an idea of the history of the characters. Now, just even looking at the character selection in there, I see our Sid and a couple of other people, and I want to know more about those guys because you see a couple of snippets of that, and even in the very earliest of the game, where uh, Sid's standing and showing a photograph of him and Noctis, his father, um, just kind of being buff young lads out on the road together, just like his son is doing again on the way to his wedding. So, what adventure do we have ahead of us? Well, we have the adventure of the title cards. Jesus! <laughs> All right, we'll just actually enjoy the music the hell out of, enjoy the hell out of the music, but we're going to actually have to take a proper look to see what this is. Um, a King Steel Final Fantasy 15 story mode. Dream Battles, I'm assuming, is something that you unlock afterwards, so we'll have a wee look at that after. Uh, ba -ba -ba, how to play, basic controls, quick slash, roll dodge, shield bash, strong slash, and companion quick attacks, square de ba, and then toggle magic type, ba ba ba, Armigia, cast magic, bam, we know what the fuck is going on. Okay, let's jump into the battle. <laughs> That's great, we're going to go with normal. So which fairy tale shall I read tonight, Noctis? I heard all the ones in that book, Dad. How about an original story? Better yet, what about you? I've certainly had my share of adventures, <laughs> but none like the ones in this book. You can exaggerate or make it up as you go along. Just tell me something new. Very well, then. It all started right here in Insomnia. A long, long time ago. He was a man of action. A man of activity. A man who moved across the screen from left to right. Oh, how he moved up and down and left and right. He was well known for moving that way. Something wasn't quite right within the city. Were you under attack? Indeed we were, but not by soldiers. Why in Eos would Wescom send for me at this hour? Where is he anyway? I love the fact that you can actually teleport up and down mid combo to actually go from person to person. Kind of very similar to the actual uh, teleport mechanic, the warp mechanic in the main game. Wow. Die. 
Like what now? Shield bash bombs will stop ticking with the quickers. Oh right, swat them away. That was weird. How did I actually manage to do that? I need to actually turn this down slightly because the actual audio is pulling back across onto my recording as well. Oh, that's the problem if I can do it audio. <laughs> Damn this great level of audio fidelity in the game. It's just too noisy. Jurassic times call for drastic measures. I hope Wescom isn't in over his head. Uh-oh. Bet you fiends didn't know I could do I could juggle. What? Ah, oh, there we go. That's how we do the aerial juggle. So square, square, triangle to launch them. And then beat, beat, beat in the air. Whoa, you kept heading them in the air? Of course, remind me to teach you one day. <laughs> Demons? I never seen during the day. It's almost like they have no will of their own. Master Skeletons can counter slashes, use a shield bash, ah, to break the guard, so it's tap tap. I got my ass beat there. What? They got you? Just wanted to make sure you were still paying attention. Now then. Oh, and I have to go back. Alrighty then. So this is actually, it is more like a rhythm thing rather than actually a good old fashioned sc uh, scrolling brawler because each of these guys actually have a reason to actually fight them in a certain way. Boom. I need 
to be a lot more careful about how I actually hit and then dodge because I'm actually tapping a lot more than I absolutely need to. Okay, so one, oh, ah, god damn it. guys to actually take a swing at me before I'm gonna knock him in the air and juggle him. here and I need to actually kind of focus because I'm losing health and he's really on the edge of the screen on me. Ah. There we go, HP. Ah, come on. Oh, come on. Are you serious? So I'm literally getting wheeled at the same spot here because of this kind of like cross guarding. So you need you have a technique for each opponent as you go along. I mean, obviously, like I wasn't expecting this to be um, insanely difficult, but I was expecting it to kind of like take it a little bit easy with the content. But I imagine this is actually not the biggest, most ex longest game in the world. <laughs>
Okay, still no sign of Wescom. How did this happen under our careful watch? To keep coming, how will we dispatch all these monsters? I don't know. But that was a checkpoint, so I'm a happy man. Dad, didn't you have any magic? I was just getting to that. I suppose drastic times call for drastic measures. Woo! Magic time! Okay. God, you're so cool. Good one, son. Oh, God, really, kiddo? Go down, you bastard. There you go. Slow device magic giving you more time to strategize. Okay, right. So the whole point of that is to do this. Oh shit. Oh, I missed that completely. Heating up, I've got to find Wescom now. Okay, let's go. Yeah! Go full Freddy Mercury. <laughs> then I find myself surrounded by hundreds of flans. Who oh, no! knew? What? Just kidding, not that many, but enough to make me reconsider dessert for a while. Okay, so what do you want me to do? Okay, good enough. Now I know how to make use of that water as well. 
these guys just don't know where when to give up. Where's Wexham? Here, sire. I jump back and call as always. My steward, I see you haven't lost your flair for the dramatic. <laughs> Boom! On the slightest, shall we? Triangle and circle. Oh, so after I can do it, I can do ooh. ooh. Okay, so it and then twenty-four. <laughs> through these guys. I believe you have been holding out on me during our sparring sessions. No one gets ahead in life by showing up to the king, sire. Oh yeah, sweet! Iron Giant. Ow. Wesky scared? Wesky? <laughs> How about we drink a Wesky, why don't you? Having companions gives you courage. Hope I have friends like that someday. Well, I'm sure you do. Someday maybe clearer closer than you think, son? Aw. Aw. No, don't give me the feels. <laughs> Chicken. Oh, crystal. Okay. All this for a crystal? That wasn't just any crystal, my liege. I'm afraid we may have much bigger problems. 
<laughs> You're up the creek without a paddle. Go, my minions. We havoc into the world and destroy the kingdom of Lucius. <laughs> Wait, what was that with the blue crystal? That's what Weskam and I were determined to find out. So, where did it float off to? We lost sight of it over the plains of Tuskay. Is it true there are animals there that are taller than a house? Taller than our castle. But even stranger creatures awaited us. Tuskay Trail. Side by side. The countryside seems to stretch on forever. We've got to find the cause of this madness. Even when the wildlife seems agitated, it's not going to be easy tracking that crystal. Then we better move fast. Gorillas are easily started and will aggressively charge the player when approached. We don't that in their dino poop. Big massive bags of poop. Okay. Why would gorillas attack you? It seemed as though they had become enraged, almost possessed. Like they were being controlled? Someone or something foul was definitely pulling their strings. Music magic doesn't work. Change to a different type. Okay. There we go. Fire. Ha. Ah. Now you're cooking. Ha. Ah. 
Back in the day, your dad was hot stuff and full of puns. Dad puns rule the roost, you know. Red and blue flannel resistant against physical attacks and purpose to magic that corresponds to their color. Yep, so, oop. Indeed, sire, but what is there protecting? I sense more trouble up ahead, so we're about to find out. Whoop, whoop! Pose! Deep force, and when call for a mechanic! That's right, run away! A cowardly lot, all of you! Would you look at that? Once it's driven off by a pure crotch idiot in us. Can't be. Sid? Well, if it isn't Reggie and the man who stands straighter than a tree. What are you doing out here? Thought I'd take a... Taking a bit of nature, but these beasts have other plans in mind. Did you not notice anything... Any, did you notice anything else since you've been out here? I did a spy a pretty huge crystal floating past. Must have landed up ahead. A crystal? Show us. Boom, so triangle and square. Right, so bam, bam, and then bam. Okay, so triangle, circle, triangle, square. Triangle, square. Oh, taking out both of the gorillas. Nice. Ah. I think that's absolutely everything dead there. 
Roll dodge behind it once it attacks to create an opening. Perform a shield stun to prevent it from escaping back into the ground. Okay. Ah! Magic death. Ah, there we go. We've made it. This isn't the crystal taken from our city. No, but we should retrieve it out of the same. Is it just me, or does it look like that crystal is charging up? Crystal battle. Find off the attackers and access the crystal. Use magic and companion attacks to do maximum damage. Just what they wished happened. <laughs> Christ. Okay.
man, that was destructive and crazy, and all I had to do was actually get back to that to do the special attack. Boom! Summon the lightning! Ramu? You unleashed Ramu, the, the Fulgarian? He sounds surprised. Well, yeah, it's just so... awesome! Yeah, I don't know what that was about. Don't know what that was about. Well, ain't that just the damnedest thing? This changes nothing! Who's there? Show yourself. Don't fret! You'll find out soon enough, descendant of Lucius. Duske, cave entrance closing in. That mystery guy doesn't seem to like you very much. Every well family has its critics. I guess, but you put him in his place, right? First we had to find him. Sid, you said that another crystal floated through here. Indubitably. Blue is the Duske sky. That's our stone. We need to catch up with it. Aye, aye, Reggie. I gotta remember to come back out to this game. Feels like there's a lot of untapped potential out here. Know what I mean? Good to see you focused on the task at hand. Why don't you just focus on your posture, friend? Of strange creatures out there and at the same time all of them wanted us dead Oh, 
no! It didn't get us. What? It didn't get us. I'm explaining because you look nervous. I wasn't nervous. Well, maybe a little concerned, but that's not the same thing. Because we can stop now if you want. No, no, you can tell me a little bit more if, if, if you want. See. Whoa, Dad, you did it! Defeated a behemoth! Well, I didn't do it alone. So the crystal's in there. It had better be. My dogs are barking. There's something strange about this cave. Something familiar. Insomnia Royal Chambers, down the rabbit hole. <gasps> so you just headed straight right in? What choice did we have? Was it slimy? Was there Marlboros? Did your voice echo on forever? It was known as the Cave of Nostal. It was brimming with dangers. Cave of Nostal, first chamber. Don't be afraid of the dark. Deflector avoid its hundred needle thousand needle gold cactars what may must be attacked repeatedly to be stunned. Okay. <laughs> Motherfuckers. Alright, fine then. Of course it didn't. They were tough, but I was tougher. I do not like getting my ass beat by cactars. Cactars? Someone's dredging up the past to add to their arsenal.
God, I hate cactars. So, cactars... <clears throat> so, cactars really exist? In this story, they do. Dad, did this story really happen or not? Shall I continue, or would you rather just go to bed? Okay, okay. What else did you fight? Is that you, Clarice? Gladio's dad? He was there too? The one and only. My regal friend. What such motley crew? What brings you into this dire cavern? We could ask you the very same. Feeling goblins... Felling goblins is great exercise. I chased a few in here this morning and must have lost track of time. Annoying little friend of fiends, aren't they? We're hunting something ourselves. Care to lend a hand? By all means, friend. Your party looks like it could use a little more muscle. Okay, Clarice is X and trying... Okay. Oof. Bring all three companions into battle before... So, bam, bam, bam. Okay. Jesus! Should I be able to do Bonds of Battle here? What was it? Goblins always attack in groups. Dispatch all of them with quick attacks, but any one of them lunges with a knife. Okay. And so falls the Bonds of Battle. Is anything left to attack? <laughs> Nothing. Ha! Ah. Have to attack. Oh, except for a tiny flan. Oh. I'd actually just used it. Damn. Completely wasted that. God damn it. Oh, no, you fuck. So, I like the summon, but it does take a fair amount of time to actually cast it after you've, like, powered up all three levels of it. That's a little bit of overkill on this one guy. <laughs> Do all caves have goblins in them? 
I would hope not, but goblins do like living in caves. Game of Nostal, second chamber. Summon your courage. Alrighty, dighty. Poor misguided fools, what an ingenious trap! Who said that? We don't know yet, but we're set on finding out. Boom! Boom! Are you guys having as much fun as I am? I'm not sure I'd phrase it quite like that, but... What's the light up ahead? Just a freight train coming your way! When it comes to be hey yeah, when it comes to be hey yeah. Our crystal battle. Bend off the attacker to protect the crystal. Use magic companion attacks to do maximum damage. See, does that do enough damage to kill everything? Yes. Haha. <laughs> it actually like literally pulls those out of the ground. I hadn't done all my attacks. <laughs> And that should be enough. <laughs> How could you survive against so many monsters? We just had to hold on long enough for our astral friend to show up. Beat you with rock! I am Titan! I like his style. Oh, that's right. You missed out on meeting Ramu. We must be getting close. Close, yes, but no cigar! You again. Some of my friends want to say hello! He's not going easy on us. We won't go easy on him. Let's go. <laughs>
Oh, shit. <laughs> I literally just used up all my magic just as I got to this point. I took you down. <laughs> Given the cell final chamber, the darkest hour. Now light, our darkest hour. It sure is dark. <clears throat> it sure is dark in here. An astute observation. What's that? The Tombray's lamp slows your movement. Beware, his attack is deadly. God damn it! Motherfucker! Lights out, Tom Berry. Oh god, I think I went a little bit over the top on that Tom Berry. <laughs> oh, poor little guy. Oh shit. Efficient way to take out flans, but oh, you fuck. Return to sender. Ah. Got these guys beat into the ground. Dad, this story is getting crazy. Oh, don't like my story. I love it, but cactars, magic lamps, strange crystals. Don't forget the bad breath. Huh? Ah! Oh. <laughs> Goddamn, Marvel. <laughs> Go down, Marbro.
I'm no fans of things with more than seven arms. Not a smile I want to see again. Anyone else smell that? Yeah, kind of smells like the ocean. Yeah, I got it. I've got the two voices for um, his friends. Time to shake things up a bit. Oh shit! Oh shit! Run like a motherfucker! Run! Oh! <laughs> you called? I have hoped my enthralled dummies would dispatch you, but now I'm gonna mop up you losers. I knew it had to be Ultimo. Talking octopus? An extremely rude one. You're behind this madness? What do you want with the astrals? They bend only to royalty, and I'm the king of the sea! You're gonna be a uh, king of Inksdanes, Octoboy. You're about to be the king of pain. Enough. Let, us, let a true king show you how to reign. Oh, Jesus! Uh, this is not good. This is not good. Oh, I couldn't even hear what he said. Damn it. Oh, shit.
You're no match for octopus royalty! Think you could defeat me? Uh oh. <laughs> so much power within my grasp. Just a little bit closer. <laughs> We did it, together. That was so awesome! First you thought those monsters, then Ramu showed up, and then the talking octopus. Whoa, slow down, my boy. That story was supposed to help you fall asleep. Can you tell me another one? Of course. Really? Yes, tomorrow night. Now, close your eyes and you and Carbuncle can dream up as many epic battles as you wish. All right. Good night, Dad. Good night, my little prince. Dream battles unlocked. So that was A King's Tale Final Fantasy XV. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough of the storyline content, the story content of A King's Tale. Um, I've got to go. I, uh, I thought, I think I, I will come back and do the dream battles as a separate video for you guys to actually enjoy because, I, you know what, this was actually a lot of fun. I enjoyed doing the character voices. I wonder if the dream battles will actually have characterization and voices in it, but uh, we'll see that, obviously, in the next video. Guys, if you've enjoyed watching this playthrough of A King's Tale from Final Fantasy XV, make sure to hit the subscribe button right up there, and that allows you to actually be able to see all the stuff as it comes out here on the channel. And, of course, over here on the side are all the other things I've been working on lately that you can check out. So you can check out that one, that one, or that one. Go and enjoy it. So, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye!